hello students in this video we are going to see how to simulate uh, the full wave bridge rectifier on pspice or cat software so this is the circuit uh, simple circuit uh, shown here uh, for full wave bridge rectifier where uh, four uh, diodes are cross connected and this is a sinusoidal input waveform v sin and the rectified output is connected across the load resistor here this is where uh, we are going to measure the output waveform right so whenever uh, there is a positive off of the input waveform is connected to the circuit the diode d1 and d2 gets conducted uh, get forward biased and the circuit is closed and see the because it is forward biased the circuit flow is like this and uh, following the closed path right it is followed with diode d2 then the circuit is closed by this way so we get uh, the rectified waveform for uh, the positive off and for the negative cycle so the path is followed in this way diode d3 is connected and forward biased and the circuit is closed in this way and the path is followed with uh, the diode d4 right and gets completed so for the negative uh, off of the input waveform we also get the rectified output as this and this rectified output waveform uh, due to the diode d1 and d2 and this one is because of d3 and d4 so let us uh, simulate it on the piece by software so open the pspice and go to file new project name the file full wave rectifier and choose a uh, pspice analog or mixed ad and locate the directory where you want to save the file and okay then create a blank project okay so the schematic window opens and then go to place and part and take the diode the part name of uh, the diode is d1 n 4002 so take the diode and i'm going to place diode in by this way and load resistor right then uh, then the input waveform is generated from v sign the component v sign is available in source library and place it here now uh, let me choose the wire and uh, complete the circuit connections right i'm going to have the connections yes now across this i am going to The input waveform is connected here and the load resistor is connected this way and uh, take the ground and ground it yes and to generate the input waveform i am setting v of zero and we need two parameters v amplitude and frequency so amplitude i am setting here five voltage and frequency for the simulation purpose i is keep one kilohertz and uh, ac zero so now the circuit is made and uh, save the project go to p spice and new simulation profile and give the name of the simulation profile here the analysis type uh, we have to choose time domain right so the run to time i'm choosing 5 millisecond because the frequency is 1 kilohertz so single cycle period is 1 millisecond and i'm going to have five cycles on my plot window and increment some ranges i'm giving here 0 0.001 microsecond apply okay now simulate the project
so the window appears plot window come back to schematic window and take the voltage level marker and place it on the line where we want to observe the waveform so the output waveform is shown as full wave rectified wave right and introducing the capacitor across the load resistor and then the filter circuit will give us the constant uh, dc output for example i'm going to add a, a capacitor here right and i'm making the and connecting it and i change uh, some range here as one microfarad yes simulate it okay so this is the output waveform uh, after introducing the capacitor increase the range of the capacitor here right which will produce uh, the constant dc voltage output so we get somehow the constant dc voltage output and the variation in this capacitor and resistor uh, values will give us a different output so the circuit is verified thank you